Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be showing you how to edit Valheim Plus for your own server or for your dedicated server. So we'll go ahead and jump into that. Now, if you're doing this for your dedicated server, you're gonna have to download the Windows server. And we're gonna basically install that the same way as we did with the uh, client. So we'll open up Windows server. Head over to Steam. Under Valheim dedicated server, we're gonna right click, manage, browse local files. And we're just gonna take all these files and drop them in here. Now, depending on if you just wanna do the game or if you wanna edit it for your dedicated server, it's the same process for both of them. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it for the dedicated server for this purpose. So we're gonna open up BEPIN uh, config and we're just gonna edit Valheim plus. So right click, edit with notepad. Um, you want to change this first false to true. Otherwise, anything you change in this file, it won't it won't work. So there's advanced editing mode. I know a lot of people like to use this. So go ahead, change that to true. And this tells you how to enter it and exit it. Um, it's a pretty cool feature in my opinion. Just under each category, whatever you change just be sure to change uh, the first false to true and that way it will actually work. Uh, you just change these to whatever you want. So like 200% increased experience. You can reduce uh, the item weight by a percentage, increase the stack size by a percentage. I think these are very helpful. Um, yeah, go ahead, take your time, read through this, whatever you want to change, go ahead, change it. Um, the only thing I wouldn't recommend changing is the inventory because by default you only have for your player inventory at least you only have four rows so if you have this at 15 it's gonna add a uh, a scroll bar and anything below those four rows any items in those if you to join a different server that doesn't have this set up all those items will get deleted so i usually just leave this alone because i was having that trouble when i set up my dedicated server with this set so to that you just do file save and then you can go ahead and start your dedicated server Anybody that joins your dedicated server is going to have to have Valheim Plus installed in their Valheim folder. That's in my first video. So this is a new character I made, so we're going to go into my server I made as well. Alright, so now as long as I'm running, I should be leveling up my skill. And if I'm jumping, it'll be leveling up because I just have it at a crazy high rate. I don't want my server to be like this, so I only put my experience right up to 300%. And then I'll go ahead and join in my dedicated server that I'm running off a separate PC so I have a whole separate file. Alright, for my server, I um, left the original four rows. I just didn't want to have any problems with the extra space and items being deleted. And then I reduced um, all the item weights by 50%. I increased the storage chest size just because I can't take these anywhere else. I increased the stack size of every item. I increased the weight for this belt to 500 and I left my player weight limit at 300. And then all my experience is at 300. I'm not gonna be leveling up crazy quick cause I still actually wanna play the game. I made very minor changes, but yeah, you can change the settings to whatever you enjoy what you want it to be. Remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.